Here are the top 15 best trophy bases, farm bases and war bases for Town Hall 12. I will explain for each base what type they are good for. Base 15 is an excellent farm base because the storages are scattered throughout the base. Which makes it hard for players with sneaky goblins to get all the loot. And we try to make it the most difficult for the sneaky goblins. Base 14, the perfect trophy base for Titan though. Because the tunnel is really well protected. Which forces lower tunnels to attack and miss the town hall. By the way, don't use this base for farming. Base 13, this could be the war base for you. The main defenses are spread across the base making it difficult to get them all and also the clan castle in the middle makes it impossible to lure. The base is amazing for defending electro dragons and sap dragons. Base 12. If you are frustrated with people who attack you with e dragons and gets the free star. This base could be your base because it is the electro dragon base because you can see the gaps of two squares making it impossible for the electro dragons to get other buildings. Base 11. This base is called a hybrid base and a hybrid base means a trophy base and a farm base combined. It is for example hard to get all the loot with the sneaky goblins. Furthermore this can serve you some trophies too. Base 10 is my favorite trophy pushing base for the Champions League. However this base is also really good against e-dragons and can force lower tunnels like tunnel 10 to try to go for the tunnel and get nothing. So you can give it a try in Titan 2. Base 9. You may think why is the tunnel on the corner again? That's because you try to defend the free star. You want to ensure that your key defenses are well protected. And it will also make it hard to get a good funnel with a siege machine like a log launcher. And when you place the tunnel in the center it is much easier for the player to get the tunnel and a good funnel. With war it's all about protecting the free star. Base 8. If you are looking for a farm base and you try to protect your dark elixir this one can be for you. Base 7 is one of my favorites for trophy pushing. Plus the clan castle is also in the middle making it hard to lure the clan castle troops. This base could work in every league with trophy pushing. It can also work for clan war league. But don't use it for farming. Base 6. Here you have another hybrid base. But this one is a little bit more for trophy pushing. So if you really want to get those trophies and farm some loot. This base can be for you. Base 5. You can see the town on the corner so this is a war base. But this one is perfect for defending against the witch slap and sap dragon attacks. Base 4. This can be the perfect trophy base for either crystal league or masters league. Where people will underestimate how to exactly funnel good. And then the troops will go around the base and you will win trophies. Base 3 is the amazing war base for defending queen charges and all air attacks. Base 2 is a great trophy base that can work in Champions League and Titans League. With the clan castle in the middle it is hard for some players to 3 star and even 2 star. It is an anti spam base. Base 1 the perfect war base. It is good against a witch slap and hybrid. If you can freestar this base, we can confirm that you are a pro. <laughs> and if you want to see how I painfully dropped from 5000 all the way to 0 trophies, you can click on this video right now.